Hello, YouTube. Hello, NFL fans. Hello, Bear fans. Wow. What a season that could have been, huh? <laughs> okay. Um, uh, I know it's been a long time since I did a video, and i tell you why. Um, I got cancer or pneumonia or something like that during the Giants game fighting Big Blue, okay, we beat Big Blue, I didn't make a video, okay, we beat the Lions on Thanksgiving, I didn't make a video, we beat Dallas on a primetime game, I didn't make a video, I thought that I was the damn uh, voodoo for the Bears, I quit making videos, man, I, every time I didn't make a video, they won, <laughs> But then Kansas City and the Rams and New Orleans and all that. Yeah, okay. We didn't make the playoffs. We have a team that uh, people fear when they come to our stadium. When we go to their stadium, people fear us. Okay? The fear is back. We're back. Okay? I blame this season on Matt Nagy. Okay? I don't blame it on Mitch. Mitch is a quarterback. Like any player on the team, he does what he's told to do. Okay? Matt Nagy should have grabbed Mitch by the damn face mask week one, week one against Green Bay and made him win that game. He didn't. He didn't several other games. Okay? We fell flat. Okay? I blame Matt Nagy. I don't blame Mitch. I blame Matt Nagy. Okay, Matt Nagy hired an offensive coordinator to cover his tracks for next year. Okay? But i tell you what. If, if the Bears don't make the playoffs next year, Matt Nagy's gone. Okay? That, 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 whatever. Matt Nagy's gone. You don't mess around with the defense that good and you don't make the playoffs. Okay, this is not the 1960 uh, Chicago Bears, 1970 Chicago Bears. This is a very good defense. With We should have a very good offense, okay? We didn't, all right? That's all I've got to say about that season, okay? Because we should have made the playoffs, okay? We should have beat down everybody. <laughs> all right, um... Let me talk about uh, the past with the Chicago Bears. Okay, I've been watching the Bears over 50 years. Okay, over 50 years I've been watching the Bears. I can't name every player that's been on a team. I, 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 I can't remember every game that's played. But I've been watching over 50 years. Okay, all right. During that time, we've only made the playoffs. 15 times over 50 years. 15 times. Okay? We're 10 and 10 in the playoffs and 2 and 3 in championship games and 1 and 1 in Super Bowls. Okay? That's, that's, that's 50 years I've been watching the Bears. Okay? We love the Bears. All right? The Bears are the number one team. The first born team, first NFL team, first NFL at George Ellis wasn't me the NFL. There wasn't no NFL if there wasn't no George Ellis. Okay, and the Chicago Bears. All right, we should be in the playoffs every year, Matt Nagy. <laughs> All right. Um, over the seasons, we've had great players come to Chicago. Okay. And we thought that we are going to be somebody that year. Okay, this has happened over and over and over. I wrote down just a few. Jared Allen, coming to the Bears 2014 from Minnesota. We really thought that that would be a turning point. Okay, Marty Booker, uh, 2000, uh, uh, 2000 to 2008. I think my booker. Jay Cutler coming 2009, 2016. All these people, man, we thought it would make a difference. 
Okay, Craig Ironhead Hayward, 93. Eric Kramer, 94 and 298. Musa Muhammad, 2005-2007. Great receiver. Alan Page, 78-81. We thought there would be a turn point. Okay, Cordell Stewart. Cordell Flash Stewart in 2003. What I'm trying to say is we get these people. And then we try to make a team, you know, we try to go over a turning point, you know, we try to uh, score a lot of points, stop the other D's, I mean, stop the other offense without D. Um, what I'm trying to say is it don't always mesh, okay? To win a Super Bowl every year, you got to have a, a coach and players that understand one another. On, on the same page, I talk about this over and over and over and over on my videos. Okay, I talk about this all the time. What the 85 Bears had was one brain. They might have had a lot of playmakers, but they had one brain. They all thought the same thing at the same time. Okay? Um, there's going to be many years that the Bears are going to fail you but there's going to be one year that they're going to light up the sky and i'm telling you it's coming it's coming we've got all the pieces in place we just need the right management to move it the coaches and the players have to be on the same page okay and the coaches need to know what the what the, what they're doing matt and aggie okay don't don't settle for second best ever don't stop don't stop don't stop win every game try to win every game every game every play you know I'm not a bear fan that's gonna give up I'm not giving up nothing I'm not giving up for this cancer. I'm fighting for life. I'm not giving up being a Bears fan. I'm fighting for life. Okay? I want the Bears to get back on the winning track next season. No predictions here whatsoever. <laughs> I want them to just annihilate everybody, which I know they can. I know they can. Okay? The coaches need to get their head off their ass. We got the players. All right, that's all I've got to say. Listen, don't try to reply to this video. I do not have the internet no more. I do not have cable news no more. I don't have nothing no more. I'm fighting for my life with cancer. Okay, that takes all of my money. I'm going to have to go somewhere and download this to uh, the internet. Okay. Um, hello, Bear fans. Thank you, Bears, for a great season. Hopefully, next year is even better. Okay? All right. Uh, I love all y'all, man. All y'all, my brothers and my sisters, my Bear family. All right? Go Bears. Go Bears. Go Bears. I hope I'm going to be better and make more videos. Bye.